Hi, I'm Sharon Pelletier Air, Miss May 1995. We are here at Pre Pageant Clinic today where 15 beautiful contestants are getting ready for the Miss Maine pageant. Now, there's a lot more to getting prepared for a pageant than most people think. It's not just about evening gowns, swimsuit, and talent costumes. These young ladies are socially aware, they're politically aware, and they are passionate about their platforms. Let's meet some of them. And what made you want to join the pageant? Originally, it was for scholarship money for school next year. Since then, it's sort of blossomed into all sorts of other reasons, um, self-confidence, friendships, and becoming sort of well-spoken. And I'm just having a blast, really. Now, let's talk about the stereotypes of pageants. Mm -hmm. A lot of people think, oh, you're a beauty yeah. pageant queen. Yeah. Um, that means you mustn't have any brains or mm -hmm. talent or ability. Yeah. What would you say to the people who do have stereotypes about what you've learned already? Right. Well, it's really funny because I never thought myself to be somebody to even try this. And what I have to say to anybody who really sorts of, sort of puts down something is you, you can't knock it till you try it. What do you think is the best part of the Miss Maine scholarship program? I believe that the best part is the fact that, yes, it is a pageant, but it focuses on the fact that girls have a talent and a reason to make themselves known, a platform, rather than just the beauty of a contestant. It's, it's about getting out there and having a cause to promote and making a difference in their community. And what made you want to join the program? Um, I don't know, a lot of different reasons. One, obviously, the scholarship is a great opportunity. And also just because um, already I've been a part of so many experiences that I, I would have never done. I've met people and just getting me out of my out of my, my box that I'm normally in. The comfort zone. Yes, <laughs> very much so. Because that's when you grow. What makes you want to be a part of the Miss America organization? Um, basically it's something I really believe in and I think that people have a huge misconception about what it is and I want to promote that it's championing young women and all of their accomplishments rather than a beauty pageant. Yeah, and what is your platform? My platform is Habitat for Humanity. It's building homes, building character. And what made you want to choose this? Um, I've actually gone to Mexico, El Paso, Texas, and I spent this January in Costa Rica building homes for um, people that didn't have any. And it's something that I've been working on in Maine, um, working with the Portland Habitat for Humanity, um, as well as trying to rebuild the one in Waterville and um, start one up in Col at Colby. So I've been really trying to get other people involved and interested and start doing some more stuff in Maine. How valuable is it to have a mentor to help guide you along the way? It's really valuable. I mean, always, always other opinions are nice, especially people who have been through the process. And, you know, you can sort of filter, take in what you need and let other things sort of roll off that you feel like, you know, maybe aren't as helpful. But I feel like it's, it's always so great to have help and different opinions because from there it's 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 truly a growing process from there you can you know take what you think can help you and brush off what you think can't but most importantly it, it speaks a lot of your character how well you accept criticism what do you hope to gain from this experience scholarship money and just experience about becoming a young woman in general what do your friends think of you being in a pageant they they think it's amazing they I mean, cuz they're all woodworkers or welders or carpenters and other art students and other artists and they it's completely outside the realm of where i normally dwell but they're really into it they're really supportive and they think that i'm doing a really awesome thing what made you want to join this program I basically um, want to emphasize global warming a lot because that is my platform, obviously, and it's, I feel very, very strongly about it. But also, I think the entire mental process of it all is very, very interesting. Now, what made you want to join this program in the first place? I knew about the scholarship opportunity, uh, but also my passion is musical theater, and I thought it would be a wonderful opportunity to do my talent on a national level. Uh, and all of the experiences along the way, I knew that uh, it would be jam-packed with traveling, and so I didn't want to miss out on an opportunity. So I said, might as well just try it. Now, what would you say to young women out there who think they might not be pageant material? I think just go for it. I, I wouldn't consider myself pageant material prior to running for Miss Maine. I was a jeans and a t-shirt, flip-flop kind of girl. Uh, but anyone can do it if you have a talent and you, you perfect your, your interview skills. Uh, it's a great experience, and it's not limited to to a certain people. Anyone can just go for it. These are skills that not a lot of people would expect mm -hmm. coming out of a pageant. 
Exactly. And yeah. that's the surprise. And that's why um, it's really hard to defeat the stereotypes of pageants because a lot of, not a lot of people know that it, there are other things that you gain from it as a person.